This question is from thermodynamics for two marks. Air is contained in a frictionless piston cylinder arrangement as shown in the figure. The atmospheric pressure is 100 kilopascals and the initial pressure of air in the cylinder is 105 kilopascals. The area of the piston is 300 centimeter square. Heat is now added and the piston moves slowly from its initial position until it reaches the stops. The spring constant of the linear spring is 12.5 Newton per mm. Considering the air inside the cylinder as the system, the work interaction is dash joules. For this numerical answer type question, the accepted answer range is 543 to 545. So let us consider the configuration given again. We will consider three states. State 1 is the initial position of the piston. State 2 is the position of the piston after displacing vertically by the amount of 8 centimeters when heat is supplied and state 3 is the position of the piston after further compressing the spring also by 8 centimeters and displacing the amount vertically by also 8 centimeters as a consequence of supply of heat. So let us consider these three states. Let's move on to the solution. It is given that the atmospheric pressure is 100 kilopascals. The pressure at the initial stage of air is given as 105 kilopascals. Area of the piston is given as A is equal to 300 centimeter square. That is equal to 300 into 10 power minus 4 meter square. Spring constant is also given as K is equal to 12.5 Newton per mm. That is 12,500 Newton per meter. Now let us consider process 1 to 2 where the piston from the initial configuration displaces vertically by 8 centimeters as a consequence of supply of heat. Let us consider at that instant that the pressure of air will be constant. So for a closed system work done is P into integral dV. So this can be written as dW is equal to P into V2 minus V1. V2 minus V1 is nothing but change in volume that can be written as area multiplied by the displacement length. So substituting the values dW is equal to 105 into 10 power 3 pascals into 300 into 10 power minus 4 meter square into the displacement is 8 centimeters. So converting into meters will give 0.08. Simplifying this will give us the work done in the process 1 to 2 is 252 joules. Similarly, let's move on for between the process 2 to 3. In that process, we have two processes going on simultaneously where the piston will displace by 8 cm and also it compresses the spring by 8 cm parallelly. So the work done in process 2 to 3 is P into V3 minus V2 plus half K X square which is the strain energy stored in the spring as a consequence of its compression. So substitute the values dW of 2 to 3 is nothing but 105 into 10 power 3 into again change in volume is written as area of the piston multiplied by further 8 centimeters plus half into k into x square. Simplifying this will give us the work done in process 223 as 292 joules. Therefore, we can calculate the total work done as the sum of work done in the process 122 plus the sum of the amount of work done in process 223. So simplifying by substituting the values will give us the total work done as dw is equal to 544 joules.